Dear brothers and sisters, let us all receive today's word that the Lord is giving us. It is from Psalms chapter 28 verse 7. The word of God says, The Lord is my strength and my shield. In him my heart trusts. So I am helped and my heart exults. And with my song I give thanks to him. The Lord is my strength and my shield. In him my heart trusts. So I am helped and my heart exults. And with my song, I give thanks to him. Dear brothers and sisters, the Lord is showing me a vision uh, where, you know, something is rising up against um, whatever that is rising up against you looks, it tries to carry itself like a huge mountain. It tries to display itself like a very huge mountain, a mountain uh, that is like as though it is made of rock, a mountain that is very strong. That is how the problems in your life, the situations in your life, the challenges in your life, that is how they try to display themselves. They try to show that they are huge, that they are mighty, they are very strong. But the Lord is showing me that is just the way they are displaying themselves. But in reality, it is we who are built on the rock. In reality, it is we who have the strength of God, who is built on the foundation of God. It is we, we who are placed upon the rock. Hallelujah. And this whatever that is trying to uh, stand against you, come against you, display itself uh, as a very strong a uh, mountain uh, has, uh, against you is not really a rock mountain. It is like a sand mountain. Whatever be that problem, that situation, whatever that is trying to come against you might look very huge. But I want to tell you today that the Lord is with you. Hallelujah. See, David said, the Lord is my strength and my shield. The strength, why you need strength is for you to fight. Strength is for you to do something. Shield is for you to be protected. Hallelujah. So the Lord is our strength. That is with him all things are possible. Because we are in Christ. Because Christ is in us. We are empowered. We are strengthened to overcome all the schemes of the enemy, to overcome all the wiles, the plans of the enemy, because the Lord is with us. Hallelujah. We do not rely on our strength. We rely on the strength of the Lord because the Lord is our strength. We have made God himself our strength. So whatever we do, we do it by him. Through him, in him. Ali Zokorte Pranchelebeheda. And the Lord is our shield. He is the one that guards us. He is the one that preserves us. He is the one that protects us. Let Rama Sokol Dolberish Napruv and Ahel Dorihitai. Al Darabala. The Lord is the one in whom our heart trusts. And we are helped when we come in this attitude in the presence of God, where we know who our God is, when we know that our strength comes from him, when we know that we are shielded, preserved, protected, covered by the Lord, when we know all these things and when we choose to trust in the Lord with all our heart. We receive help. Hallelujah. Le prate so cordoro. And when we connect to the Lord, when we are able to see this picture, then we automatically walk by faith. We automatically are empowered. We are strengthened. We know that that problem that is trying to display itself as a huge mountain can do nothing to us. We know whatever that is trying to display itself as something great, something mighty, something that is too strong for us to overcome. We know that it is nothing because we are stronger than it is. Hallelujah. That's why the word of God says, uh, greater is he that is in me than he that is in the world. You know, when the enemy becomes great and mighty in your life, when you consider him to be great, when you think he is nothing and when you know what your position is in Christ and who you are in Christ and who Christ is, when you know the reality, the truth of this, you automatically walk 
you know, with that power, with that authority, knowing that the enemy is a defeated one, he's already put under your feet. Today, the enemy is trying to display himself in a very great and mighty way in your life. But the Lord is speaking to each and every one of us. Like David said, let us make God our strength. Let us know that he is our shield and let our hearts trust in him. Let us know that we are helped. We are not left alone. We are not people who are weak. We are not people who are left alone to battle and struggle and die. No, we are empowered. We are backed up by heaven. Let Horoko se martili shama da hasia day. We are helped by God. We are empowered every day. We are strengthened every day that we may overcome the wiles of the enemy, that we may stand against the power that is trying to deceive us by displaying itself as a very great thing. We will put it to shame because we have the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. So today, whatever be that problem that is trying to exalt itself and that is trying to show that you are weak and that problem is great, please look at that problem. Visualize it. As you are in the presence of God, visualize it. Know that you are already an overcomer. Know that that problem is under your feet. Know that it, it is not as great as how it displays itself. When our, when our reaction to a problem is fear, anxiety, and you know discouragement, disappointment, if that's how we see a problem, that is where our failure is and that's what the enemy tries to use. Hallelujah. Today, let us know that the Lord is our strength. The Lord is our strength and our heart exalts in him. And we rejoice and we, you know, sing to the Lord. We give thanks to the Lord for all his goodness, knowing who we are in Christ, knowing how, how much we are backed up by heaven, how much we are empowered, how much we are strengthened, knowing that we are already victorious. Let us receive this word from the Lord. Let us go ahead to pray in tongues. And as we pray in tongues, visualize Whatever be that problem, whatever be that situation that you are going through, visualize that it is already defeated. It is already overcome by you. It is already, you know, put under your feet. Know that Christ is with you. That is what you have to see. And what you see is what you will speak with. Is That is what you will believe. And that is what will happen. You are not defeated. You have Christ in you. You have Christ with you. You are powerful because Christ is with you. You are not called uh, to be a victim, but to be a victor. You are called uh, an overcomer, a conqueror. Not by your strength, not by your grace. Uh, but by Christ. The grace of the Lord is sufficient for you. The Lord tells you today, do not fear because he is with you. He says, don't be afraid for I will strengthen you and I will uphold you and I will uh, you know, give you, I will lead you, I will uphold you with a victorious right hand. Today, all that you have to declare is, I can do all things through him who strengthens me. Not by your strength, but through Christ who strengthens me, I can do all things. Don't believe uh, the lie of the enemy. Don't believe uh, whatever, however the enemy tries to display himself. Don't believe it. He is defeated. He is put under your feet. Declare Christ is my strength. Christ is my firm foundation. Christ is my strength. Christ is my righteousness. Christ is my strength. Because Christ is my strength, I am an overcomer. Because Christ is my strength, I am a, I am a victor. Because Christ is my strength, I am a conqueror. Because Christ is my strength, whatever that stands against me cannot uh, continue to stand. Uh, our help comes 
comes from the Lord. Our strength comes from the Lord. The enemy cannot stand. The enemy cannot continue to operate in our lives. He is defeated. All the wiles of the enemy will be cancelled. His plans will not be executed in our lives. That problem I see that has come against you in your family. No, it is not a rock mountain. It is just a sand thing. It is not at all a rock mountain. Know that you are positioned. You are having authority. You are empowered. You are a rock mountain. You have authority. And when you speak, you can put everything to shame. When you command, whatever you command, that is how it will be. Because God has put that power in, inside of you. He has placed that authority inside of you. You are the child of God. By speaking, by taking over, by standing in your position, by knowing you who you are in Christ. You can overcome anything that has come against you right now. Let Rossi, you are not called to be defeated. You are above that problem, that financial condition, that health condition, that issue that is seen in your marriage or that problem that is, you know, jumping and uh, displaying itself as great in your life. You are above it already. Stand your ground. Don't give up. Stand your ground. It is not that you have to fight and do something. You are already victorious. Stand your ground. Stand in that truth. It remains the enemy always tries to show that you are weak that you cannot do it it is not the truth the truth is you truth is you are strong just choose to speak what the lord word of god speaks about you just choose to speak that don't speak your situation don't speak your problem don't speak you know what uh, what you see around don't speak tarakesko torobehela speak the solution speak the word of god speak what the lord says you are empramadizo toraketi rishahati witchcraft cannot stand against us black magic cannot stand against us itrasi sickness cannot stand against us cancer cannot stand against us financial burdens of financial struggles or huge mountains of of financial debts cannot stand against us le the name of Jesus Christ. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. There is no limitation to me. All things is my portion. In everything I'm victorious. By the authority that is given to me, the name of Jesus Christ, I speak. He comes. A change in all the reports of my life. The reports of health, the reports of finances, the reports of marriage, the reports of job, the reports of business, the reports that I see around me, I change it. Every report is favoring to me. Every report is favoring to me. Anything that stands against me will stand for me in Jesus' name. Whatever be the mountains that is trying to display itself as great and mighty, it is nothing. In the name of Jesus Christ, it is defeated. It is put under my feet in Jesus' mighty name. I am victorious over it. In the name of Jesus Christ, whatever be the problem that rises up against me, like a huge mountain, like a mighty mountain, it melts away like wax it melts away like wax in the name of jesus christ nothing can stand against me as a as a hurdle nothing can stand against me as a stronghold the enemy might try to show you that you are weak that you are defeated that you cannot do it and that 
uh, that you know the chance of you overcoming is like already gone the enemy might try to show you all this but the enemy is a liar you have to know he is a liar what is truth is what the word of god says about you christ is my firm foundation Christ is my strength. Christ is my shield. Christ is my righteousness. Christ is my victory. No matter what be your situation, hold on to the peace, says the Lord. Hold on to the peace. That is a peace that comes from the Lord. A peace that surpasses all understanding. And that peace comes when you choose to speak the word of God, when you choose to rejoice in the Lord, and when you choose to give thanks to the Lord. There is a peace that rests in your heart. There is a peace that encircles you. Allow that peace to rest upon you. Receive that peace. I declare the Lord is my strength and I stand firm in him. The Lord is my strength. He is my firm foundation. The Lord is my strength and I stand firm in him. The Lord is my strength and I stand firm in him. My heart fully trusts in the Lord. My heart fully trusts in the Lord. I am what the word says I am. I am what the Lord says I am. I can do what the Lord says I can do. I can do what the word says I can do. The Lord is my strength and my shield. The Lord is my strength and my shield. The Lord is my strength and my shield. He gives me the strength to overcome. He gives me the strength to fight. He gives me the strength to o- be victorious. Lavas kenderes amar terribles, and he is my shield that preserves me, protects me, covers me from all the wiles and attacks and the arrows of the enemy. Illa masitor me kenderes labratia sans. Christ is my strength, and Christ is my shield. Ura mandere behendro brasia tenebrehis lahata. I am unshakable. Ikator belihida because I am rooted in Christ. My Christ is my firm foundation. Therefore, I am unshakable. I stand firm in the ground that the Lord has put me. I stand firm in my position. I stand firm as a child of God. I stand firm with the word of God. The enemy is defeated. The enemy is defeated. The Lord is my shield. Shield. He protects me from all harms. I cannot be harmed. I cannot be harmed. Nothing can hurt me because I walk by authority and stand in authority. I am rooted in Christ. I come in the name of the Lord and therefore nothing can hurt me. Nothing can harm me. Christ is my shield. The Lord is my shield. I am covered. I am protected. I am preserved. Either brother na so than a candle in resinike is the harabad. No matter what be the mighty storm that comes against me, I am not afraid. I find peace knowing that God is my strength. God is my strength. Therefore, I am at peace. Leprasi, this storm that is coming against me cannot defeat me. It cannot destroy me. God is my strength. The peace of the Lord that surpasses all understanding is operating in my life. Therefore, I am at peace. I am at peace. I find peace knowing God is my strength. In every stop. Christ is my helper. I am helped in the name of Jesus Christ. I declare, I am helped. I am helped. My heart rejoices because I am helped. Let Rasidi, my heart trusts in the Lord, and I am helped. I rejoice because I am helped. Alla trosi terebe sondera brehid la shura. I give thanks to the Lord because I am held. I give thanks to the Lord because the enemy cannot 
defeat me. He cannot rise up against me. I give thanks to the Lord because the Lord is my strength and my shield. I give thanks to the Lord because I have helped in all situations, in all circumstances. Whatever that comes against me to destroy me cannot touch me. I declare it in Jesus' mighty name. My heart rejoices because the Lord uh, helps me. I am confident because the Lord fights for me. In Pradima Sohonde, I stand my ground. I stand my position. I stand my ground. In Gadigana Sopra Tebara, I am strengthened in my inner being. I am strengthened by God's power. Malake Soto Korpelihita, Christ is in me. He is, he is living inside of me. I am strengthened. I am empowered by God. Kortolo Sobar Telebish Lahadi, I am strengthened by God's power. I am strengthened as I meditate on the word of God. I am strengthened as I speak the word of God. I am strengthened as I am in the presence of God. I am strengthened. My strength is renewed in the Lord every day. My strength is renewed every day. My feet are like the feet of us. Lebrashi of a team. Lega Sandra Embra diga Sotro Beli Kabalaha. My sight is like a sight of an eagle. I gathore ne copra tina salime het la rahashli hindarabe. I am strengthened. My strength is renewed. Alla ke sondo in the Lord every day. Alla basande ne krode ne mekashi. My strength is renewed in the Lord every day. My strength is renewed in the Lord every day. Oh, Prade Basiko Tolberish La Prandeni Zahadi. I am victorious through the strength of the Lord, by the power of the Lord. I am victorious. God is my shield. No weapon formed against me can prosper. God is my shield. No weapon that forms against me shall prosper. Tari zatolo breheda. The weapon of the enemy that stands against me cannot remain. It cannot prosper. It cannot stand against me. It cannot rise against me. In the Ramasokotori Beli God is my strength. No weapon formed against me can prosper. Talkeria salabrehenda undrodoho. My heart overflows with joy because my God is with me. My heart overflows with joy. I rejoice. I rejoice. I rejoice. There is nothing that I have to be afraid of. There is nothing that I have to cry about. There is nothing that I have to weep about. I choose to rejoice. I make it a choice. I choose to rejoice. My heart rejoices in the Lord. Because this problem that is seen in my life cannot destroy me. It cannot touch me. It cannot alter anything in my life. E da maze corodo basihita rebele caparatia. Alpeti, my God is with me. Like a shield, he is with me. He preserves me, he protects me, he covers me. The wiles of the enemy, the schemes of the enemy, the plans of the enemy cannot stand in my life. Christ is with me, he is in me. I am in Christ. I am empowered every day. I am empowered to do the will of God. I am empowered to walk in the ways of God. I am empowered by the Spirit of God. To operate in authority, I am empowered by the Spirit of God. To be victorious over the plans and schemes of the enemy, I am empowered by the Lord. I declare it in Jesus' mighty name. My faith is firm. I do not speak what I see. I speak what I want to see. And what I speak manifests. Because I speak it in the name of Jesus Christ. I am rooted in the word of God. I am above all the wiles of the enemy. I am above all the schemes of the enemy. I am above all the plans of 
the enemy. I am never alone. The Lord is always my strength. The strength of God enables me to overcome every obstacle, no matter how big, how huge, how mighty it is. The name of Jesus Christ, I declare, God's strength enables me to overcome every obstacle. Therefore, I stand firm knowing God is my sheep. I stand firm being rooted in the word of God. I stand firm. Labartele. I trust in God's protection. He is my strong tower. He is my strength. My confidence is in the Lord who strengthens me. No matter what be the situation, I rejoice. I sing. I give thanks to the Lord. The Lord upholds me with his righteous right hand. In times of weakness, God's strength is perfect in me. I live in victory because the Lord is my strength. I am helped by the Lord and I am not afraid. I am helped by the Lord. My help comes from the Lord and I am not afraid. I declare it in Jesus' mighty name. I do not allow fear to operate in my life. I rebuke all kinds of fear, all kinds of discouragement, all kinds of disappointment, all kinds of anxiety and depression, all the all kinds of stress and pressure. I rebuke it. I get it out of my life in the name of Jesus Christ. Peace. I praise God for his strength sustains me daily. I praise God for the strength of God sustains me. The presence of God sustains me. O Shama Rabba Sekotrobeli Prahadi. I am empowered by the Lord. O Labari to fulfill his purpose for me. I am empowered by the Lord to fulfill his purpose for me. I am empowered. I am equipped. I declare it in Jesus' mighty name. I trust in my God. I trust in my God. The Lord is my strength. The Lord is my shield. The Lord helps me. I trust in the Lord. My heart exults and I sing a song to the Lord. I give thanks to the Lord. I rejoice in the Lord. I bless the name of the Lord. Because the Lord is my strength. Strength and my shield. I am in Christ and Christ is in me. Ulash Lebratin Sohol Barhida. My help comes from the Lord and I cannot be defeated. I cannot be shaken. I declare it in Jesus' mighty name. I declare it in Jesus' mighty name. I declare it in the mighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Praise you, Father. Oh, Rabba Shetere Bala. Oh, we bless your name. We love you, Lord. We praise you, Lord. We adore you. We glorify your name. We praise you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Gracious and loving Father, we thank you, Lord, for this wonderful time in your presence. We thank you, Lord, that we are built in you. We thank you, Lord, that you are our strength, you are our sheep. We thank you, Lord, that no matter what be the situation, we are helped. We thank you, Lord. We choose to rejoice. We choose to sing. Thanks, I give thanks to you. We choose to bless your name. We choose, Lord, to rejoice in your presence, knowing that you are with us, Lord. We praise and thank you for everything, Master. We thank you, Lord, that we are overcomers, we are conquerors, we are victors. Thank you for this wonderful time in your presence, for empowering each and every one of us. Thank you, Father, that you are with us. You will strengthen us. You will protect us. You will preserve us. You will lead us in triumphant victory. We praise and thank you, Father. Lord, I speak your blessing upon all these people. Bless them abundantly. Anoint them. Thank you, Lord, that you are with them. I pray, Lord, may their eyes see your presence. May their heart rest in you and receive that peace from you. May they be able to sense your presence with them. May they be able to receive that strength from you your presence, Father. May they be empowered. May they walk, Lord, uh, with your strength, with your power, being covered, being shielded by you. Thank you, Father. You be with them. You guide your people. You instruct them, Lord. You lead them in triumphant victory. 